Alright guys, welcome back to the channel. Thanks for clicking guys. Um, I've just finished work. I've come out, I wanted something to show you. I want to show you something. Um, what it is, it's a rapid deploy ridge line. It's not something new guys. But I've been looking at my ridge lines. I need a bit too, uh, there's a bit too much going on. So I wanted a simplifier. So, I'm out in the woods. I'm going to show you everything I got now. Um, what materials I'm going to use and how to make it up. Easy peasy, Japanese. -y. Let's get started. So, first of all, guys, use my chest rig. I have done a video on it, but I've decided to use it for my basher bag. So, I've got my British Army. DPM basher in the main compartment I've got cordage in one of the pockets and in the front pockets I've got six pegs so before we get started guys and I'm not trying to teach any of you to suck eggs the first thing you do is check for widow makers okay now what we're looking for is beech trees you do want to be setting up under them because they suffer from something called casabine failure, spelled with a K. It's a disease. Not only that, they um, they're a low-lying root tree, so you see them falling over in strong winds. So that's the first thing we've done, and we're good to go. So let's talk about the material we're going to use. We're going to use bank line, okay? The reason we're going to use bank line is because it's going to be doubled up anyway it's super strong it's more compact than paracord it's waxed so it's waterproof and it's UV protected what we're going to tie today guys we're going to try three lengths of jungle knots I'm going to show you how to do it now Again, easy peasy, Japanesey. I'll show you the way I do it. So first of all, we're going to measure off seven meters, okay? And how you do that is from your chest to your arm is about a meter, okay? So one, two. Three, four, five, six, last one, seven. So you're going to cut seven meters, okay? And then you cut it then. At the seven meters part. So that's done there. Seven meters, okay? So what you do is then get the two ends together. There they are there. And just tie an overhand knot. like so come back to the other end so this end now is going to go to the grommet on your basher so just tie a simple over and not there let's move on to the next stage so this is how you tie your knots okay take in your hand in between the thumb round the little finger Not too tight. One. Start again. Round the thumb. Wrap around the little finger. Two. And again. 
and you just go so on so on see so I'm gonna do R now to the end of the seven meter piece of bank line okay back to you soon there you go that took a couple of minutes okay so I've got two here to go on one end uh, when each end of the basha I always carry three, three with me and the reason I carry three is in case I need to extend one so here's how you connect it to the grommet and the basha through the grommet and then pull everything through so you put in all those knots through and it's as easy as that so that's now connected to one end I'm going to do exactly the same now on the other end of the basha right so I'm going to go around the tree now guys with my jungle knots okay so if it's a wide tree just walk around there and try and reach around there There you go, I'm round the tree, right? Oops. Sorry guys. I'm round the tree. So what you do here now, pull tight. I've connected it to the other tree. So what you do is you choose where you're gonna put it through. Open it up, open the hole up, pull through. And lock. It's as easy as that guys. So that's locked there now. I'll show you now in a minute how taut it is. That's all you do. And it's a quick release. Take these off so you don't do it. So when you wanna bug out, that's all you do is pull like so. And tighten up. It's a friction, so you guys work on friction. I'm pulling my basher tight so I'm going to use this scap here so I'm going through the hole and lock in if you want to put a toggle in for extra security there's really no need though you can always put a toggle in as well for added security that's not going nowhere guys that's not going nowhere it's as easy as that it's quick it's fast and it's super easy and they will stay set up like that now they can either leave them on the basha or put them in my chest rig so there's a closer look guys Does that make sense? See? As solid as houses. So it's connected there and the opposite side. And then it's just a question of pegging out your basher. And there's my shelter up. Probably took about two and a half minutes, guys. So again, when it's time to move out, it's all you do, pull your knot back through and away to go. Pull it through and it away. And once more, how you set it up, so you taut, tighten it up against the tree. See the knot there? So that's going to fit in there lovely. Open up the hole, pull the knot in, and that jams up against the back knot. Like so. 
and again when it's time to leave leave your harbour it's funny guys it's all there it is pull it out like that just quick release quick deploy and quick release so there you go look you're out of the shit out of the rain you got protection from above from the sun you're out of the wind less than two minutes so that's it guys so make yourself three seven meter lens use bank line you can use paracord but it is better to use bank line okay and it's super strong so you're gonna worry there and uh, you can either leave them on your basher take them off it's up to you I've just taken mine off now and I said this is now my uh, shelter pack I'll put the card up here of the vlog I did on this okay it's cracking with a kit but I know now where all my shelter is okay I got my pegs in here I got cordage I got my jungle knots and I've got a basher so it's all in here so um I hope that helps guys um please punch that like button get this channel moving and um yeah try it out um I say you can do the trucker's hitch and the, the bow line and all that but this is so simple guys this is this is beginners level so say faffing about because not everyone's great at knots luckily enough I'm very good at knots but I'm sticking to this now I'm getting rid of all the other uh, ridge lines and things I'm sticking with these jungle knots they're the way to go thanks for watching guys and thanks for clicking on the channel as always it's always much appreciated um, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing. I'll see you on the next one. Out! Oh.